It's National End the Fed Day, and these people say that they are sick and tired of being robbed. It's a criminal enterprise. Anybody who charges usury and money laundering and counterfeiting of money, I mean, that's what the mafia does. What makes me mad about the Fed is the fact that they're, they're so secretive about how monetary policy is. They just keep on printing more and more money. And everyone knows you can't run a printing press and create wealth. Some Americans are calling for a sound monetary policy and an end to bailouts. Though not many people showed up here in Washington, D.C., a growing movement of citizens concerned with this country's fiscal policy will gather in 39 cities nationwide at each Federal Reserve building. Some claim that the Federal Reserve system is at the very heart of the current economic crisis, which these days might be beating out of control. Debbie Kruger is a former Marine and mother of five. She helped organize this protest. The Federal Reserve is monopolizing our money system, and uh, I know people that are working three jobs and still can't make ends meet. It's just sad and disgusting that we don't have the same quality of life that we used to have. The way they're using the money is, is a disgrace. You know, all the, fi the foreign wars that they're um, fighting for no reason and uh, based on lies and... You know, the Federal Reserve itself is based on lies. Another Marine, young Adam Kokesh, served in Iraq and has been a vocal critic of the war since leaving the U.S. Marines. I think that the Federal Reserve uh, is, is uh, the driving force behind corporatism in America and the military-industrial complex, which, of course, is driving our imperialist foreign policy. And often they have no regard for human life or morality or decency. Dina Gosofsky, RT, Washington, D.C.